Okay, soldier. <laughs> okay. How you doing, Doc? Um, oh so God. we're doing uh, my one of my favorite drinks. I have one of these every single day, pretty much, if not more than I one day. Uh, it's kombucha. Yes. Considered with a weird hippie drink. We're really gonna drink water right now. Uh, he, Way he, to interrupt the video. He's drinking water. Looking this is food. Yeah. Um, we're gonna look at him staring at me like, wow, rude. We are gonna do a, a kombucha taste test. Um, I don't drink kombucha very often. It's not something I seek out. I do like it, but it's you know again not like something that I'm like, oh, I can't wait to have one. And yet David has one every day. Yes. So we are on polar ends of the spectrum here. So hopefully we'll get some interesting commentary about each one. We made it a base of strawberry because I didn't want just plain. That'd be perhaps a little too much for my taste buds. But I thought, give it a little bit of flavor, strawberry as a base. They all have like other random crap added to them, but. Sure, we'll talk about, we can talk about what's in them. Yes. Um, so we're going six different ones. Mm -hmm. We're doing do uh, Brew Doctor, which I think, I think I've had. Brew Doctor? I think I've had that one. California Craft Babe Kabucha. Mm -hmm. Hum, which I have had. Okay. Uh, Synergy, which is one of my to go to go tos. Uh, Rowdy Mermaid, which is actually to be a tonic, which I never actually have had before, and then Health Aid, which I have had and have opinions about already. <laughs> so well, hopefully this will change my mind or confirm. My there mind. you go. We'll and we're uh, going to judge on taste, aftertaste, flavor potency on that strawberry side. Right. Carbonation and overall kombucha taste, with yeah. one being the wow, I did it backwards, didn't I? On mine, yeah, you did. one being the worst and five being the best. <laughs> I'll keep you in line. Uh, <laughs> so, to, and to clarify, the flavor potency is the, the strawberry. Like, do they put enough of the flavor? Yeah. Um, strawberry. Everyone has a strawberry, so again, we, one you don't like regular kombucha anyway, so right. flavor. Um, and if they're not put enough of the strawberry in there, the others I feel probably very much the same. Yeah. Um, the kombucha overall flavor uh, for this, for everyone, is uh, how much does it taste like kombucha? I like the kombucha flavor. Right. Mm -hmm. So it might kind of mess with, with them, some some scores. Um, we'll see. But they just completely just get rid of it. It's just like sugary strawberry. Right. Or the kombucha is there, the earthy. Yeah. There. Okay, I can see. Okay, I yeah. see that. All right. Yeah. All right, all right. Okay. I'm excited. This is going to be an adventure. Should all right. Let's go. Here we go. Number one. That was loud. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't anticipate that. So, first one is which one is this? Is hum. Hum. Probiotic kombucha. Whole 30 approved. Um, absurdly tasty, they say. Mm. Did you do whole 30? Was that? Was no, that? Oh. I've never in my life done that. Oh, okay. No, no. But I do like that it comes in a can. Most kombucha I've ever seen comes in a bottle, so yeah. I, I do like that. Um, I mean, yeah. We didn't do oh. like a. We're not judging on the look, so it, it it's not. It's very clear. Pink, it's like very you, clear. It's kind of clearish. Ooh, it does smell strawberryish. So. Oh, that's yummy. So I do like so hum yeah I've had them before. Ooh. Um. Yeah. Okay, and it doesn't say if there's like it's called strawberry blossom, so it doesn't like some of the other ones tell you. The other flavors involved, but this one just says blossom on it. That's pretty yummy. Yeah, I mean it's a very middle of the road. There's no, there's no strong. Like, I don't think the flavor in any way is overly strong. Mm -hmm. So it's like I've had some that are like, oh man, it's almost like it's gone bad for me. Yeah. Um, that one's very from middle of the road flavor wise. Aftertaste, there isn't any for me. No, it feels those, fine. Those are my which I don't like. I like it. Oh. I like <laughs> to, like who wants to drink something and be like. I have something to drink in there. I want to. Like, I'm okay if it goes away. Well, oh, yeah, we're so weird. So if it was like, if you were having like, what's something you like to drink? What's your, what's your, what's your drink? It's not coffee. Me. Okay. Do you like to do the taste of coffee? Yeah. Okay. So what if you drink coffee and then you do the taste right after you drink it? I'd be fine with that. Okay. We, we're different people. <laughs> we are different people. Yeah. So I, okay. I like the taste. I'm doing a four. I'm gonna do a four for aftertaste because there really isn't one for the flavor's me. not the flavor potency is not really strong strawberry. No, but it, you do tell that there's like a fruity flavor there. Yeah, the strawberry is very light. I don't know what they use. It's a good green tea, black tea. Apple gelato juices. I'm gonna do a three point five with the flavor potency. Yeah, because I it's think not super strawberry, yeah. but it's it's a good like you can tell there's some kind of 
very involved, I guess. Yeah. Carbonation is there. not super high. No, not at so all. So are you are you gonna I don't know how you're judging on carbonation. I like a mid road. If it's over carbonated, it's still like gassing. And yeah, 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 yeah. If it's, if it's flat, there's like, it just kind of misses something mm -hmm. in the flavor. Okay. Carbonation should be mostly natural. Right. Like I made a kombucha myself the other day. Oh, we're going to have to do a, do a whole episode on that then. Um, and uh, carbonation, uh, it's hard to get in there, but it should be mostly natural. So you should it have feels some like in there. It's a good balance on this one. Flat. Yeah, it's really good. I like carbonation. It's not too bad. I'm glad I asked because I no. wasn't really sure. One thing I'll say about bottles, if you go forward, sometimes bottles tend to fluctuate in the carbon carbonation. Okay. So if we have like under carbonated, they're not that great. Some others are like overly carbonated at times. But I hope okay. we get a good idea of what these look like. So. Okay, overall kombucha taste, I don't really taste it. I don't either. I don't like that. But, like I, I, I don't like taste little, it at all. I like a little kombucha flavor in mine. Yeah, I mean, I might as well really be drinking like a juice because yeah, you, you can't really tell that there's a kombucha in there. Or a, um, I'm going to do like a 2.5 on the kombucha taste. It's all, honestly, to me, it's almost like a, um, uh, um, oh, what's like the, the LaCroix? Oh yeah, thing? like a sparkling water. It's like, it's like a favorite sparkling water, but like, I don't like sparkling waters, so. No, kombuchas yeah. are, are high off. If you're supposed to be vegan, they have they all they have by B twelve in them. Um, yes. Probiotics. So if you look for probiotics, they're great. It's um, pretty yummy, though. I mean, if you're not a huge kombucha flavor, totally original flavor, then you're gonna like it because it is it's pretty sweet. It's like having juice. So yeah. um, we'll see. We'll see how it turns out in the end. But mm -hmm. I think not being able to taste the kombucha might hurt it a little bit. So we shall see. On to the next. Now you see, <laughs> like a weirdo. I'm doing this because the plan was to have like a little break here, guys, and then pause it, then start it. I'm gonna like have this coming in and yeah. merge it because I think it's funnier that way. And this is mostly in here for myself and to annoy everyone else. Um, we're not annoyed. We love it. I love the name of this. It makes me think of my friend Melissa, Rowdy Mermaid. Come on, that's a great name. And this is a strawberry tonic. It is strawberry hibiscus. Raw chicory? Sure. I didn't read. Um, and dandelion root. I yes. wrote it on there. Yes, there chicory? Is, yes. Uh, what is that? You know what chicory I is? Remember. Okay. I don't remember. Um, it's very light in color, just like the other ones. Like, no smell. smell. Ooh. Okay. See, that's like a funky taste I don't really like in my kombucha. Okay. <laughs> um, it's not as bad as some others I've had. You could at least taste the kombucha sauce. Yes. So, I mean, flavors are bad. That's drinkable. It's really fine. It's nice. Yeah. It's crisp. It's refreshing. So it fine. is. It's refreshing. Um, hmm. It's fine. It does um, make me think of um, literally like ginger ale. Like a... Taste is fine. Nothing to write home about. Yeah, I'm going to say... Um, flavor potency, I don't taste anything. Of it. I just taste very flat. Kind of... It's not flat in, in, in the sense of bad, but just very... Yeah, there's if, not a lot of strawberry there for sure. It's almost like they put the kombucha down and then put some strawberries next to it. Mm -hmm. And it was like, you guys have a conversation. It's even Time. less than a, like a White Claw. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Which is like barely a hint of flavor. Right. Okay, so carbonation I think is, is fine. I like the carbonation. Um, yeah, carbonation is more I would say the kombucha things. flavor is a little bit better than it was in the last two that we yeah, had. Yeah, it's so there. It exists. Not too bad. It's there. I was a little worried because I don't like hibiscus flavored stuff, and I don't really so taste do. that. So I do, and I don't taste it either. Yeah, it's fine. If I mean, all these was very expensive. It's only a couple bucks. So if you want no. like a little tonic, a little you know probiotics, a B twelve going. You want anything that's overly powerful in flavor? It's pretty good. It's yeah, pretty cool. I, I would. I would. I'd. Get it again if I wasn't in the mood for something strong in flavor, or yeah. if I was just like, oh, I'm trying that flavor. Yeah. yeah, and I maybe if I'm eating something that's strong in flavor, and I just want this to just kind of be there as my drink, then yeah, this yeah. would be great. Okay, not, not bad. bad. Yay, like that. good. Okay. Okay. On to the next. Man, is there a doctor here? <laughs> There's what? a doctor, brew doctor. I almost said Dr. Brew. <laughs> Thanks for like... Brewing it. Getting it right on. Perfect. Right. Well done. Brew Doctor. Brew the bottle. Scoot about the bottle. Um, Brew Doctor. Love the shape of this bottle. I, I love that it's like an old school kind of feel to it. It's like a little medicine bottle. Yeah. Like apothecary. Yes. Yeah. And it's like, an, like a real twist off top. 
Strawberry fields. There's literally pictures of strawberries. We well, better not just point. Come on now. <laughs> I'm some strawberry. I love the name too. So let's see. It's also yeah. pretty clear. No smell as well. No. No. It's like it's like smelling water. The fuck is that? <laughs> oh no. Yeah. See. <laughs> this, is, this is this is this is one of the like stuff. It's got almost like a foot smell taste to it. <laughs> Tastes like what a but oh, old no. sock. I don't like this. It's <laughs> no. Which is to do, do this? They have a weird sock flavor to them. I'm like oh. Oh. I think no. Now I smell like a sock. And then if so, say you're a new vegan mm. and you hear all about kombucha, how it's so good for your gut health, and you need to drink it. And you, sorry, brew doctor, but you <laughs> tried this first. You're gonna be very upset. You're never gonna try kombucha it's again. Vinegary, but not like that. But thing. not like a kombucha you know, vinegary. So like, usually vinegary, it's as good as a vinegary because they're, 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 they're fermented. But this tastes like white vinegar. Oh, okay. Like yeah. White vinegar. Oh, <clears throat> I really yeah, not do not like this. There's no strawberry to it. I don't know what you're talking about. Um. The carbonation, again, I feel is fine. I feel like they've all done great on carbonation. Good for them. <laughs> yeah. It's got a little bit more of a kombucha flavor, I'll so I've got to give you that. that one, sure. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm, not, I'm not feeling that one. I do not like I'm this. I'm too with Strawberry Fields. I'm <sighs> like, oh, man. Where? Where? Point it to it. Point, point it out. They're not really. They're not in here. That's for damn sure. Okay, well... Damn, on to the next one, I guess. There we go. <laughs> I have some strawberries at this point. That's all it's coming down to. <laughs> Literally should have just bought a container of them. Okay, so. we are on to Health Aid Kombucha. Strawberry. Strawberry Glow. You're correct, yeah, yes. Glow. And David has opinions on this one. I will, before he shares them, I will say I like the bottle. I like the shape of it, the old schoolness. Not really a big fan of the top, but I like the bottle. What are, you, what? what are your what are your opinions? I've had some before, so I'm not gonna say okay. too much. I've had them before. There's no color to it. I no. of them. It smells like vinegar. To me, it smells, it smells better than the other ones. Oh no! <gasps> yeah, this it's a feet. It's like a feet thing for me. I don't know what it is. Not as bad as that. I've had other flavors I don't like, but there's but it's not as bad. You are not. Happy. <laughs> <sighs> oh no! Okay. Aftertaste is fine. It kind of goes away, which is okay with this one. <laughs> uh, flavor potency. Oh my god! I think there's a strawberry in there more than the other ones. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Carbonation is, I think, a little too high. Um, can we talk about taste? Oh, you is... think it's a little too high? I mean, yeah, I think it's too high carbonation. Yeah. Oh, you do see a lot more bubbles in it than normal. Mm -hmm. Okay. When you take a drink, it like it, 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 it foams up in your mouth a little too much to me. Oh my! So it does have a kombucha taste to it. Yeah. I will say that that's the highest one so far, but it's mm, not the best. Which uh, I'll say that I agree. I agree with your your opinions. Yeah. Oh man! Course, Come course. on, last one. This is David's favorite. We're about to try. Please. So I definitely have. I hope so. Please. All right, on to the next. There you go. My tummy hurts so bad. Because <laughs> we've had bad kombucha. Um, okay, we're on to David's favorite. Synergy Raw. Yeah, this is done by GT's, which is a fairly like well-known um, uh, uh, kombucha. Um, I mean, all kombucha is kind of the same price, so I'm not going to get too much in cost. But um, as, again, I like all of their stuff. I have no problem with it. So I'm interested in how you think about it. It's got color to it, yeah, which is like the first color, one. Yeah. Very simple in flavor and smell. Hmm. It does smell like strawberry. Oh my god, that's good. It's like strawberry, right? I like this one. It's oh, this, so this, this is the one that got me started. Oh, I'm so excited. This is the one that got me started because it didn't have the too much, too much, too vinegary on it. I have taste of strawberry. Yeah. Um, flavor potency is there. Mm-hmm. Carbonation, it's mid-row, not, not, oh, not too much, not too little. It's kind of, it could be a little carbonated for me. 
Yeah, I, yeah, no. you're right. It could be a little bit more. It's a little bit less than the other ones. There's good like kombucha flavor to it though. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think that's my favorite so I'm far. Who wins this one? Then. Mm -hmm. Better. Shut it down. Um, we can already tell you, but we'll be back with our scores and what we think. So far, this one seems the best. I wish I could show you the color. There's, um, it's exciting to see some kind of color. The yeah, others were all clear. So that pink to it. Yeah. So cool. Pretty yummy. And a big bottle too. There you go. All right. Be right. Bring it on back. So. So let's talk kombucha. Um, I'm pretty sure you know the winner. <laughs> Let's just see how bad the other ones did. Okay. All right. Come on. <laughs> All right. What was your uh, number six? Uh, California Craft Babe Kombucha with the coconut. Ugh. Yeah, I was twelve point five. It was. I was. It wasn't mine. Mine was Doc Brew Doctor. I thought I'd be California Crappy lower, but yeah, Brew Doctor. Yeah, Brew Doctor was second for me, the lowest, and it was thirteen. Okay. So I got yeah. a ten on that one. Okay. M number three. Number three. Well, let's say number four. Okay, that one is Health Aid. Mine too. Yes. Okay, which I was surprised because it was not really good. But yeah. uh, your number. Oh, some, no. oh wait, no, that was number three. Yeah, number, number three. Four. No, number two. Yeah, we go. Number two. Yeah. No, we never did three. We did this one. That's number four. So now we're gonna do number three. Okay, number three. Number three, I actually. Math is I hard and kind of backwards back with words. <gasps> I like I mean, number three. Living. Hum. Hum was good. Same. Hum was 14, pretty good. 14 yeah. for me. 18 for me. I give higher scores than David. Though. Yeah, I'm <laughs> very uh, judgmental with this. Uh, okay. Uh, number two. Rowdy Mermaid with 18.5. Barely higher than Hum. It was good, though. It was pretty good. It was, it was fine. Yeah, there wasn't too much to it. So whether mm -hmm. you like the kombucha or not, you're going to like it. It's pretty middle of the road. Sure, sure, sure. And then number one. Synergy. Synergy. GT Synergy. It's good. It's the only um, one I like. <laughs> I would say the only one I do have regularly is the Kroger Simple Simple Treat. Okay, uh, so. I didn't, I didn't bring that one with me. They don't have a straight up strawberry one. They okay. have like a strawberry lemonade or something like that. Oh, weird. Um, but. Uh, I'll I have did, to try I did, it. I tried that one. I do like that one. There's, there's real, I don't like their sugar free ones. Okay. Or the low sugar ones. Those aren't very good, but they're not. The regular ones are pretty good. Just said. I'm going to give this a shot too. But um, I, do, I do think synergies are better than that. Those, though. But they are pretty good. We might have to do a, a second version of this at some point because there are so many other brands out there and they are all very different. Yes. Like, there's not shockingly not different. So, so if, you're someone, yeah, if you're someone who says, I don't like kombucha, then just, you know, if you want to try one, try different ones. Yes. Um, maybe like something that's not strong in flavor or more regular kombucha flavor or has more of a dirty sock flavor to it. I don't know. Maybe we'll just use this video to help you because. Mm. Honestly, Synergy is it, but Rowdy is pretty good too. Right Hum is all right too. I like those three. Those are probably the best ones so far. I just want to find Hum and Target. Oh, that's um, handy. That's what I found. I found that one a lot. Um, they sold a ton of it there. Okay. So I'm supposed to find it there. And it's actually pretty, pretty good. It's not, it's just drinkable. I wasn't my favorite, obviously, but it's right. drinkable. Okay. Cool. We did it. We Kombucha taste test. Full of probiotics. So full of probiotics. Okay. Thank you. We yeah. want to hear if you have any other brands because I do think we could do another. There are tons. Yeah, we could do know. another episode. So let us know your favorite brand of kombucha. We might have to order some to get them in, but I think that'd be fun. Very fun. Yep. All right. Well, until the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.